Hello guys, welcome back. Well, welcome to the uh, first Ravenport series with five people. Um, <clears throat> we had a huge storm last night, and um, we got trees down in the middle of the road. <clears throat> so yeah, um, dispatch said I gotta go around and uh, clean them up. Yeah, it's just a little kid literally blowing up over something. I don't know. <clears throat> and then uh, there's two other people talking in the background. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, oh, we got stopped cars in the middle of the road. Yep, there's a down tree. Get my, get my lights on here, just so we don't get more traffic backed up in the way. All right, I'm just gonna throw these off on the side of the road and then I'm gonna get my gooseneck later and with my normal truck and then I'm gonna come grab them. <coughs> Man. Get those out of the road a bit more. How many? Well, do you, have you seen any others that are in, kind of down? Okay. If you need any help, um, I can come down after I'm done doing this. Ethan, there are quite a few down here on my place. Alright, and do you have a chainsaw? Down here's where a lot of the wind was. Yeah, I have a chainsaw, and I have a tractor. All right. I didn't know you had a tractor. Yeah, I have a tractor. What, what tractor is it? 1206. Mm. Oh yeah, you brought it to school that yeah. one day. Yeah. Dang. I'm over here working on kind of trying to make a pile. Oh, out of we got a tree down over there. Hold on, let me turn around in this guy's driveway. Help is on the way. This guy's mailbox is facing backwards. It's a kind of odd. Never seen that before. I got my lights on. Road closed, people. All right, there's a turn right up there. So all right, grab his chainsaw. Big boy chainsaw. Where, where chainsaw. Mm -hmm. Probably cold start. Ran off diesel, man. Diesel chainsaw. Oh. Probably never heard that before. Pretty rare. Yeah, it sounds rare. Yeah, just take out the gas tank and make it a diesel. I've seen a guy do that before. It's gnarly, man. Mm -hmm. On today's episode. You want to experiment first? This is one big old tree. <clears throat> It's because uh, they lost their uh, Barbie doll. They kept it outside, and then the wind took it, <laughs> and they're oh. crying. <clears throat> Look it up, child. Slap that bitch. I said slap that bitch. Okay, cattle. Um, the town hired me this for, since uh, it's gonna be pretty bad this winter with the uh -huh. snow. They hired me to uh, plow off all the snow. Didn't yeah, they hire same. you too? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, we can get that knocked out then. Yeah, this winter. Yeah. So we're gonna have to start making up routes to take. Yeah. I'll do my. I'll kind of do my side of town. 
So are the are the trees in the in the road or? I got one of them shoved back, and I'm cutting it up right now. All right, I'm on my way. Oh, well, that's your place. Man, you did get a lot of trees down, didn't you? Yeah, you don't say. Hey, I, I'm actually, I'm going to bring my, uh, my goose neck and down and, uh, grab all the, uh, wood. And then I'm just going to haul it all to the sawmill. No, uh, yeah. And they can chip it. I'm going to take some, too, because I need some. The sawmill's literally right across the road from my place, I think. Yeah. Yeah. All right, this uh, d hey dispatch. I am going ten seven for a while. Um, we have a lot of wood in the road, and I'm going to uh go grab my gooseneck with my normal truck and haul it. So I will be ten eight probably later today, if not tomorrow. All right, I just called. I just pretty much said I'm not going to work no more. For the rest of the day, pretty much, yeah. All I have to say is I'm going 10-7. Which means I'm going, I'm going off, off, off duty, pretty much. 10-8 means I'm, 10, 10 means I'm available. Well, but they like their code words. Come on, Gates, go up. Barely. The train was already gone, and they're still bing, 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 bing. It sounded like my old Chevy. Ding, 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 ding. Them new Fords. Yeah, I I own two Dodges and my wife owns a Ram. One of them Ram vans. The fuck is a Ram? Different Dodge. It's a it's pretty much Dodge. It's pr pretty much a brand new minivan. All right, cattle. Um. So, do you want to start driving your tractor down here to town, and then? Well, actually, no. I can. When I was cutting up the trees, I just cut them onto liftable pieces. So, yeah, I shouldn't need your help. How much? Well, I mean, I'll let cattle do it because supposedly cattle needs a lot of money. Uh, cattle, if you want to go do it, you can. Oh, I'm going to stay and help clean up around my place, too. Okay. I'm trying to figure out where they want me to put this wood, because they keep saying right here, and then they move me to a different place. I mean, the main thing is, at least we got it out of the roads, you know. Um, were you making bigger logs? Uh, no. Mm, so they were just like liftable pieces? Yeah. So they're gonna probably bring you over to the chipping station then? Yeah, if they would ever show me where it is. I'll get it in just a minute. <clears throat> Man, this show is pretty funny that I'm watching. Uh, it's kind of like a podcast show. I do the conversation. <clears throat> Man, if it's getting annoying, I can uh, mute it if you guys want me to.
All right, last log from this tree. Yeah, Avery's still out of town. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty much, it's, uh, yeah. He's been out of town for a while. You don't say. I already did. No. It just went straight to his little voicemail saying you robber. Okay. Flashers on. Here's this tree. Pull over. Some guy just kind of walked right over it. All right, this one shouldn't be too hard. Man, this one's heavy. Man, that's a heavy tree. That log was pretty big. Oh, this is the uh, log where the uh, tree split. Well, if you floor it, I'm gonna pull you over. Oh. Cattle, you still got any other trees by your place? Yeah, I'm loading some right now. I just sold a couple. This load is sketchy, so... No. There we go. No. Why? So, Kendall, are you going to need me to come grab some of them logs? Yeah, there's some down here on the side of the road. Okay. I'm over here loading a few right now. Okay. Yeah, I got a pretty big load of logs right now. kid thinks he's Spider-Man. No, you don't. I'd have to sell him because... Yeah, cut him on my way down there. Do you, though? No. No. Because you're going to get the money off of it. Okay, well, you're going to have to wait there for a while because I'm loading up a load. Oh, just drop it off then.
Good thing I have long straps. It's a good thing I have long straps. Otherwise, I wouldn't be holding this right now. Hopefully the sheriff isn't over here, because if he is, I'd be getting pulled over. I am the sheriff. Yeah, but hopefully you're not right here where I'm going, because it's a good thing I have long straps. I'm off duty. Yeah, I, I got them too. They call them the uh, quality ratchets or something. Um, no. If you were to come up here where I am, you would see what I mean. I need my tractor, because I'm stuck. So you find out where they're uh, having you take the uh, wood? Yeah. Okay. Okay, there's a lot of small twigs. Can I just kind of leave them away? Yeah. Okay. I'll burn them later. All right. But I gotta kind of. Yeah, help these out decent truck. size these decent size logs I'm bringing up there. I kind of gotta help out my truck. It got a little stuck. Because them uh, small little sticks and stuff, they're not gonna want them. They'll take them, and they just give you like five bucks for each. Still pretty decent. Just don't come over here and look at what I'm doing. Well, no, I don't want to. I'm walking off the road, it'll be fine. Ooh, look at that crap. Okay, I got out of it. I have the long strap 3000. That was only $782 for not that bad. giant tree. It's not bad. No, it was like 17 meters. I don't know. I don't know what meters are. Neither do I, but that's what they said it was. They're just weird. Huh. Hey, I have some money now. More than a thousand dollars. I still wouldn't be complaining. Some hundred dollars for a tree is pretty good nowadays. Yeah, you see all these little twiggies. <laughs> oh. This ain't DLT really approved. Fine. Just load them. Here, can you get these all cleared off to the side? I'm gonna go haul this down there. No, don't. Pull up here. We're loading hmm. these. Okay. The more money, the better. Ain't gonna. Don't scratch my paint on my truck, no. It'll be fine. So, do you, I'm gonna have to do you live them? at this house right here? Yeah. Mm. I'm gonna have to sell them because otherwise they're gonna give you the money. Well, and no, because I have a, I have a bunch of the town's logs that I cleaned up on here. They're four. No, you only have you only land. have like one tree on here. But still, so they're just... four. They're on my land. Okay, I'll give you hundred bucks because that's what the tree's worth. Maybe two hundred because that's more closer mm. to what the tree would have been worth. But alrighty. Hundred. That's what we're getting. Cause I am yeah, indeed. I cut it up and I hold it for you, so you gotta pay me for labor. All right, come, come on show where they're at. All right. Where do they want these? Is it? I think it's uh right here, isn't it? Yeah. All right, here I will click it. I will tell him. Uh huh. Okay. Here, they I'll gave give you, you half money. of it. Seventy-five percent of it. How much did you make? A thousand. Give me five hundred. Okay. 
Well, 700, because, uh, um, the labor and stuff. And most of it was my indeed trees. That's 600. Give me 100 bucks. Give me 100 bucks. No. I don't have any more to my name. All right, Coop. Are there any trees down by your place? Okay. You still need help with that hay? All right. I will head up there then. I'll pull in my gooseneck if that's all right. I was doing it to haul wood and I'm not gonna backtrack all the way up here, so I might as well just bring it with me. I'll be there in a couple of minutes to get my hay. Kelly, uh, I can haul it for you. Cause I, I have the gooseneck. Yeah, I'll probably have you do that. <clears throat> I'm gonna charge you the hundred bucks you still owe me. Why? You have it in your shed. I'll part you need for it. I I I bet you I could uh, fix it right now. I bet. Well, I mean, I could probably get it up and running just for today. I'll be alright. Okay. Alright, where'd you cut that hay at? Because <clears throat> I was trying to turn around. I'll be alright. There you go. Okay. I forgot to lower it. What do you mean? Cattle things. Just got right back on. Uh, God, I'm gonna kill that horse. <laughs> I'm gonna kill that thing. Damn, Cattle. Do you have a permit for that horse? Yeah. Does it have does it have proper license plates? Um Yeah. Yeah. It's not obviously on your vehicle, so that's a citation right there. This doesn't identify as a vehicle. Yes it does. It identifies as a service animal. It's nineteen ninety, it can have pronouns. Well it's ninety nine actually, but uh oh well. Yeah. I'm gonna kill that horse if you get in my way. I'm not stopping. He'll be fine. Cowboy will be fine. His name's Cowboy. Yeah. Oh god. You ain't gonna shoot this thing. I wanna you bet. You shoot it, I shoot you. You can't shoot me. You shoot, you shoot it, I shoot you. Well, Cattle, I'm a cop. The fuck is a 12 gauge? Buddy, it's 99. Stop making things up in your head. 12 gauge is a shotgun, buddy. You're living under a rock. Buddy, since when? I know it's a shotgun. I'm not dumb. 
I've heard of them. They're coming out next year. No, they're coming they're out next year. Yeah, they are. What do you mean? They've been around since the since like the fifties. No, well, they haven't. Not a twelve gauge. Yeah, they kind of have. Mm. When was the last time you slept? Last night. Where's Cowboy at? Dead. I'm this little nigga. I'm gonna take out the Apache. You have an Apache? Yeah. yeah. Is that a horse or, or a trip? A thing. A what? A thing. Oh. Yeah, it really yeah, I is. Know. I'm on my way with my Apache. Is it the old Chevy? I'm assuming it, it's a uh, Chevy. But yeah, he doesn't have the money to own one of them. I wouldn't say that. Hmm. How the hell do you know I have four thousand dollars? <laughs> Started tending over your windrows. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make sure it's all nice mixed up, you know. Hey, that's it. That's what the name was whenever I bought it. You were dumb. I'm faster than you. I'm not going 20,000 miles per hour there, son. Yeah, yeah. I kind of, that, that horse isn't street legal. Yeah, it is. I'm not even on the street. What do you mean? You were, you were obviously walking it on the road. Riding I it on the road. On street. I'm riding it in the middle of his pasture. Well, to get here, you were on the road. And it's not street legal. No, it wasn't. You don't have any turn signals, you don't have any brake lights, no, you ain't got no headlights, you ain't got no license plate. Mm-hmm. I'll put the license plate on the tail. You ain't got no, uh, windshield or cap, Oh my god. Least. Okay. How much are we getting paid? I'll go get the bailer out for you. Or do you want to let these sit and dry? Where is my Apache at? Okay. Well, guys, I'm going to end the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and come back for when Avery and... What's his name, guys? Come on. Blake, Blake. or something? Yeah, Blake. For when Avery and Blake come back. So, goodbye.